With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone. Two similar point charts Q1 and Q2 are placed at a distance r apart in air. The force between them is F1. The electric slab thickness T which is less than r and dielectric constant K is placed between the charges. Then the force between the same charge is F2. You have to find out the ratio of the two. So if we talk about the forces between two charges Q1 and Q2 and uh, the distance between them is let's say R. So I will write down the force between the two is K Q1 Q2 by R square. Now what happened here? In between them a dielectric or dielectric constant K and uh, thickness T is kept. This thickness is T and this. So we know that what happened here. When you insert a dielectric in between the two charges, what happened here? For this reason, the force changes. What happened? If you calculate the R dash, it will be equals to T into K in the root. So T distance in this dielectric self slab will be R dash equal, will be equals to R dash times of the distance covered in vacuum. So this will be the equivalent distance, equivalent distance in vacuum. So if I write down, now let's say the distance between them I write down it is R naught. So it will be equals to R minus T. This is occupied by vacuum. So it is occupied by vacuum. And uh, what we have done here, occupied by vacuum. And what we have done here, we found this equivalent distance in vacuum. So it will be this. So this will be the change distance now, right? And as we can see here, the Coulombic force is proportional, inversely proportional to distance between them whole square. And we want the ratio of F1 by F2. If you see here, we want the ratio of the force between the same. So we want here F1 by F2. So let's find out. I will write down F1 by F2, as we have seen, it is inversely related with the distance between them square. So it will be this. The change distance we already got, it is this. So I will write down it is R plus T into under root K minus 1 whole square. Initial distance was only R square. This will be the answer of this question. Now you can check for the option. If you see, it is R minus T plus T under root K by R whole square, that is C. C is the correct one. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.